Hey guys, and welcome to Game of Thrones. We're going to be going on to episode 4, I think this is now, and we'll be carrying on straight from where we, we ended the last time, and yeah, that's all we're going to do. And uh, sorry about there being a very big delay in the last video. I'm very busy, I will not be able to do any, any videos for next week either as I have now as because of work. Um, and that like uh, because of like I've been asked to work over some holidays and that sort of thing, so um can't do very much previously on Game of Thrones. So I've been asked to work on Friday, so I can't do anything. My father is planning to make a move against your family. He knows all your weaknesses, all your plans. That's what really what most of them do. Because you have a traitor in your council. He's been sending a great deal of gold to someone in King's Landing. We were told we'd be speaking to Lord Tyrion alone. That's enough, Andros. I can't edit it all together. Some shit story for little kids. I've heard stories. Old tales of a secret well, forest so within really a forest. Excuse, so Your know. lord knew what he was talking about. I'm part of the free folk. People round here call wildlings. I don't know, episode 5 is also My out now, so I'm, that's what I'm trying to like, get this done, get this boss, dusted, get this all out of the way, and I'm finished. Someone I can yeah. trust. So and we'll get to episode 5 and, and hopefully not still um, when this, this goes up, when this video way. goes up, episode I'm sorry. 4 I'm going to tell Father of the patrol uh, is off. Life is Strange will be finished. That'll be up. Marine. And I'll be able to be able to play that, I'll be able to what? do that because it's a brilliant there. game with that episode. I don't want it's to like this type of thing. If you presume to speak of my dragons, you best choose your words carefully. Are you going to be a good little forester, learn your lesson, and stay down? You can be Lord Roderick, so long as we all know who holds the reins here. Because we found out, um, the foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. Things in episode Take three, the boy of your lord. I think Kill I would have found out. If they give you any trouble. I never did tell you about your father, did I? We bled him at first, like a pig. <laughs> I was glad to do that. He made, made him suffer. So if there's any glare on my glasses or anything, I hope it's not too distracting. I'm trying to do it so that there's not too much glare or anything. I knew you were a killer the day you arrived. Seems Brit found out too. Now they all see it. No, what sort deserve. of brother you really are? Yeah, that's definitely. Brit yeah, was the much. killer, and worse. He got what was coming to him, and you made sure he got it, didn't you? Threw him clear off the wall. You tried to lie about what you did to get here, but we both know you had blood on your hands. But now. You've killed one of your brothers. You'll lose your head for this, Tuttle. He never did like me, did he? You'll be disgraced, dishonored, and burned to there's nothing left yeah. of you. You won't execute me. With Mance Raider coming, the Night's Watch needs all the men it can get. Honest men. Loyal men. Not brother killers. There's only one thing to be done with you now. Hey, Frostfinger! 
saw what Garrett did to Brit last night. I was there. No, was there? My relief was late, so I, I stayed by him. Yeah, he was there. Then go on. What did you see, boy? It wasn't Garrett's fault. We were on watch when Brit just attacked him. Garrett had no choice but to fight back. There isn't a man at the wall wouldn't sell his own mother for the right price. You two are up to something. Oh, please, and who's that? Some oh. deal you worked out. Or oh, he's defending he's you the truth, for the truth, but the reason I can't fathom. That's it impossible. Finn can't stand me. Because you're a fucking squire who thinks you're better than everyone. Enough! Garrett killed the man of the watch. There's a price to be paid for that. Let's go. I knew it was a mistake to make you a ranger. <laughs> Rossfinger. I was right. He doesn't like me. What's to be done with him? We're heading to Cruston. You'll have to find someone else for your expedition. Your man here still has a lot to answer for. Now out of the way, Snow. Give us a moment. And then kiss him quick and be done with it. Garrett, I know you said you couldn't promise anything, but this, what happened? I thought you were smarter than that, Garrett. I thought you were going to be by my <laughs> side. I know I did the right thing. That's all that matters. What Brit did to your family? Anyone would want him dead. But now you'll have to face the consequences. But John... I'm sorry, Garrett. There's nothing more I can do. We're down a man, so keep your eyes open. Now let's move. Seems if, um, one has abandoned you. Any of, but any of you have seen the Game of Thrones? The Axeman of Science is Let me know with, um, without, by, by giving a spoiler warning first, unless the people know that I'm not to look at the comment if they haven't seen the episode, let me know in the comments below what you thought of the last episode with, um, and what happened like, yeah, and the events with Jon Snow that, that was the like, very few scenes in Game of Thrones took me by surprise that was the one episode I was severely shocked to see it and knew I wasn't expecting anything like that to happen. And I, want to, and I want to know what you guys think of that episode, if you have watched it. Um, for those who haven't seen it in front of it and don't want spoilers, um, please give a spoiler warning beforehand or if you like, I just want to know your own opinions and that sort of thing. Summers of Winter for episode 4, and episode 5 is in this stop vipers. Whoosh. How many men have stood before me? Well, aren't they meant to be in black? Of my dragon? Sure. Desperate men, hoping for wealth, protection. Liars, every one of them. And I expect you are no different. You don't want to see what I do to liars. Are you calling me a liar? You know nothing about me. You're right. I don't know you. I thought you'd seen a dragon before. Your reaction says otherwise. He's much smaller than the other one. <laughs> Would you like to touch him? Go ahead. 
Unless you are afraid. Of course, a man who has really faced a dragon before may have reason to be afraid. Uh, take a crow for it, why not? He likes me. You still have a hand, don't you? You claim you saw Drogon. Give me a reason to believe you. I told you I've heard this story before. I'm going to need more. My friend has the burns to prove it. It's likely to leave a scar. Your dragon did this. Well, he wouldn't. You must have tried to fight him. What have you done to him? If you've hurt him, hurt him. He attacked us. Drogon wouldn't strike without reason. You must have scared him. He is not some kind of thoughtless beast. He's only a child. The men who were following him, the Lost Legion, they drew their swords and tried to fight him. And Drogon defended himself. So we somehow deserve to be burnt alive because your little baby was scared. Your tongue is dangerously sharp, Selsword. Why did you come here? You offer me nothing but lies. To what end? You want gold? A title? My undying gratitude. I need help. I don't That's want money. I just need your help. Help very often means money. My family is depending on me. I have to find an, an army. army. If you could spare some of your cell swords, please. If... I also came here looking for an army. But what I found were the cries of children and people suffering in chains while their masters profited from their misery. My cell swords will help me free the slaves of Marine. That is their mission. Your need is not greater than theirs. These are people who have suffered for years. Once the slaves are free. Once the slaves are free. I will sail back to Westeros and reclaim my crown. There is no after. There must be something I can do to convince you. Oh, trust you, Dragon. As we speak, my men prepare to enter Marine. What they are about to do is much bigger than you or I. Bigger than one family back in Westeros. So, unless you think you can storm Marine and free all the slaves yourself, you have nothing more to offer me, Croft. You may leave. Oh, that's but it. Your Grace. Best knows the city better than anyone, Your Grace. What the hell, Asher? Is this true? Yeah. Oh, Asher. 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 So you wish to accompany them? You'd help the Second Sons. Guide them into Marine. I can't, Asha. This could be our only chance. Is that what you're saying? You're really considering this? Yes, yes, yes. I'll speak for myself. I'll go alone. She's the one who knows the city. She will accompany you, or you won't be going at all. I believe that's more than fair. You two will join Croft and his men. Get them into the city, help them liberate Marine, and I will see that you are rewarded. But your uncle stays here. If I find you've lied or put my men in danger. I understand. Good. Croft will get you settled in. It's going to be a long night. You we didn't want to go back to Marine. What the hell was that? What's the problem with you and Marine? Up, anyway? Marine. It doesn't matter now, does it? Best get. get your armor packs up in here. Extra bed rolls if you need them. Piss buckets in the corner where it's always fucking been.
long time since we had a piss pocket. I spent two years trying to get where I am now. Don't you fuck this up for me, Asher. Nail! We got two more! your leg that's a problem, Roderick. You've got to be practical. You want to take Griff down next time? You want to stop lying in the mud and letting people walk all over you? You're speaking to your lord, Sir Roylan. He can fight his yeah, own battles. So. Look at me, Roylan. You can barely hold this damn thing, much less swing it. So, you're going to give up then? There are other ways to fight, my lord. You can't handle a sword like you used to. So find another advantage. Surprise your opponent. Do something unexpected. Like what? I'll show you. Come at me. <laughs> Bring your opponent down to your level. When I attack you, drop down, avoid my blade, and swing at the back of my knees. Wait for me to attack. Roderick! Yes, you see. Let's try it again. Ha! Now that's how you do it. <laughs> I think you let me. Oh. My lord, sorry to interrupt. Elena? She insisted on seeing you immediately. Lady Elena, I'm sorry to hear we won't be sisters. Talia. Roderick, can I speak with you? Privately. You remember my little brother? Quiver! Good gods, you've grown. You could just call me Arthur now. I hope you don't mind us coming unannounced. But something's happened. I didn't know what else to do. Maybe this was a bad idea. I've missed you, Mr. Lane. I've missed you too. Truth be told, you're the only one I can turn to. Lord Whitehill to crossing. He told my father Griff had subdued you and... And that my sister would make a fine reward. As if I'm some token to be handed around. You mean? He demanded I marry his son, Griff. What? Lud threatened to my family. Told my father if he refused, would be slaughtered along with you. Jesus Christ. My father acted the damn coward. He agreed, Roderick. I am to marry Griff Whitehill. That arrogant, pig-eyed prick. Then you are to defy your father. I intend to. Do you think I want to marry that disgusting pig? But my father won't listen. I'm not going to be the bone they throw that howling dog. I'm not going to be some prize for him to rip open. We have to get rid of him. I can't think of any other way. My father won't see reason. Talk like it's as simple as walking up to him and putting a knife in his arm. He's protected by a garrison of his own soldiers. We have a way around soldiers. that. Nice, he's put his own soldiers for me. You brought your men. I command father's elite guard. These men are trained archers, swordsmen, experts in both ranged and close combat. They're yours, if you'll help us take down Griff. The whole guard? 
20 men. My father still thinks they're aboard a ship bound for the Reach. What do you have to lose, Roderick? Griff has been a nightmare for you and your house. You can't have any reason to keep him Stop around. Wrong. Why he'll still have my little brother? If I hurt Griff, there's no telling what they'll do to Ryan. I understand your worry, Roderick. I don't want Ryan hurt any more than you do. I know this might sound mad, but it's the only way. Get rid of Griff, and you'll be free to use the guard however you like. You can finally take control of your house again. Please, promise me you'll do this. I love you, Roderick. I don't want Griff. I don't want any of this. I would be happy to. Thank you, Roderick. Griff won't even see it coming. My men are yours to command. Thank you, Griff. Cool, I've got my little secret service. That's cool. Secret service. Oh, that's cool. You don't know how much this means to me. I'm sorry I couldn't marry you before. Maybe when this is all over, we could play hide and seek in the grove again. Pretend we're still children. I love you, Helena. I love you too. Because, uh, you know, you just don't, you don't just have an opening and you just don't take it. No, you, go the, you go for the whole shebang, you do. Another coronation already. Our kings just get younger and younger. Tommy's not ready. Um, He's too soft. <laughs> Maybe that was the imp's plan. I wonder if Marjorie Tyrell will be here today. You mean Queen Marjorie? She was married to Joffrey. <laughs> For all I of fancy one hour. Marry his brother too. Not to I mention put Cersei it and Jamie. Shh. The Lannisters have spies everywhere. <laughs> Our secret chats everywhere, aren't they? I think he's going to become her squire at some point, isn't he? What is it, Tom? Remember that warning you'd heard from Roderick? About White Hill's contact? Did you find anything? Only whispers. But your brother's right. Blood White Hill. Blood White Hill is sending a great deal of gold to someone here in King's Landing. He's definitely up to something. I bet it's one of those Ironwood merchants. Lord Morgren and Lord Andros. It's hard to say. Lord Whitehill is surprisingly secretive. They'll both be at the feast after Tommen's coronation today. Maybe you can learn something. to get to the feast. I can't go. Marjorie's... She's not exactly oh, happy okay, with me right now. Knows. I've been uninvited. Couldn't Sarah help? Ask her to get you in. She'd do it, right? Don't handmaidens look out for each other? Sarah's not really happy with me either. Some things I may have said. Well, if you need Sarah to get you in there, you might as well try, right? It's nearly time. Just be careful, Lady Mira. King's Landing seems to have it in for you. Somewhere that like, could be like a, the escapeless thing. I'll dig down, dig forward, and dig up, and you know, the end of the game. I'll be fine. Late in the evening, so I'm yawning a lot. <laughs> 
I'm not sticking around to use it. Onions Ooh. and crab apples. That's food. At least I won't starve to death. If I ever find a way out of here. Hmm. I'm just doing anything. Yeah, that'll be useful. Oh, wood's rotten. This is all bloody useless. Oh, I'm not getting out that way. Mm -hmm. Don't know what I expected. Just sand. Probably covered with fleas. Oh, this one looks loose. Garrett! Cotter, what are you doing here? I heard him talking. He had to be executed in the morning. What about Finn? He told Nobody them. Nobody believes him. Or don't want to. They think he's covering for you. Some are even saying he helped you do it. I have to get out of here. That's why I came. I want to help. And you'd be executed too. Why would you want to help me? I told you my secret. And you said you were my friend. Well, what kind of friend would I be if I left you to die here? So I'm getting you out of here. I don't want to hear any complaints. You're a good man. You're a good man. You know that. Don't go singing my praises just yet. I want you to take me with you. To the North Grove. You know I can't stay here. I'm leaving Castle Black, but I'd rather not go it alone. So if you're going north, I'm coming with you. Well, I need to find the north I'm not going road. anywhere unless I can get out of this bloody storeroom first. I can try and pick the lock, but I'm not sure it will work. It's rusted a bit inside. I can try, but There's a loose it may stone. not do any good. There's a loose stone over here. Can you see it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It's not moving though. Keep trying. Let me see what I can do. There's a trowel. There's a, that's a trowel. Can I cut that? Seems a form of Get knife. Anything. Run the last piece. See it. It's coming loose. I'm gonna try to push it out. You pull, all right? Heave, pull, yay! That's what the wire stands for. Yay! Hey, can you fit through? I think. Try and find a way out now. Took down. You two idiots, lucky I'm not Frostfinger. Thought you were being sly, eh? Oh, Finn. Am I glad to see you? I'm the sword in the darkness. Help me a fellow brother keep his head. You'll need this. Now, 
Let's go. You're not coming with us, Finn. What are you on about? Frostfinger already thinks I'm helping you. What do you think he's gonna do when he hears <coughs> you've run off with a potato fucker over here? I'd rather take my chances with you. And I'm good in a fight. You know that. Yeah, good at starting them anyway. You'll need another blade at your side. Have another one. ranger along with you. And he stabs you in the back. Yeah, there are bloody white later. walkers out there. Move. It's the north. Or the south. Or the north's north. I'm confused on how it works. So either way you look at it, it's either side's north of the wall. North, and you've got north. Ah, oh, they've got a colour. Stupid thing. There's no turning back now. We're deserters for sure. We're breaking our vows. I've taken plenty of oaths. I've broken plenty too. Words don't mean shit. There'll be a price on our heads. <coughs> the vows I said here, I meant them. I was a brother. But the Night's Watch betrayed me. And that's on them. They know we're gone now. Then how fast can you run? Alright, I'm gonna leave that here for now. And I will see you all in the second part of Game of Thrones. Thank you for watching.